What's inside today? A cordless keyboard. Oh, quite a bunch of screws here. They're already there. Okay, inside the battery compartment. There's no screw, okay. And I think this should be everything. Screws. Oh. Oh, I've a little bit of electronics there. Well, let's see what... Okay, this is the electronics device here from this keyboard. And there are two quartz oscillators rated 13.54 uh, and 13.57 megahertz. Um, so there are two frequencies and I think this device is looking for the best one to be connected to the receiver. Uh, by the way, the receiver, I forgot the receiver over there. Let's see what's in that receiver. Okay, this is the back side of the receiver. And as you can see, I can't find any screw. But the screw is inside this rubber pad here. See, this can be peeled off, and there you are. There's the screw inside. And after peeling off the four rubber pads, you can see there are four screws, so this thing can be opened very easily. <laughs> the blade of the screw screwdriver is magnetic. <laughs> see. Okay. Oh. And there are some more quartz oscillators. 10.3, 10.1, 16.4, 10.72, and no, 10.27 and 10.22 megahertz. That's interesting. Okay, this is the board again from the, from the receiver. And here I have a lens system I took out from an old uh, photocopying machine. But uh, as you can see, this one has a yellow filter inside. I don't know exactly why this is yellow. But it's okay, so I can show you some more details by filming through it. Because my simple camera here just does not have a, a, a macro vision function. And as you can see here, these are the frequencies on which this device works. MSE is mouse, KBD is keyboard. And so you have two frequencies for mouse and two for keyboard. And as you can see, this is quite near or even inside the civil broadcast band. I think all these uh, electronic components should be able to reuse, uh, should be able to be reused somewhere else and maybe we can especially use the LEDs here again labeled LD1, LD2, 3 and 4 the switch here might be interesting Okay, uh, let's see how far we can zoom in with my lens system. You can see here the board is compared to the uh, battery. This is um, this is a double A sized rechargeable battery. And let's see how far we can get this.
Just zooming in. This is the battery again. As you can see there, very big battery. And these are the electronic components here, SMD soldered. Q9 here is a kind of transistor. R65 with a resistor and this brown, these brown components here C6 and C7 are capacitors and this rectangle shaped thing here is an integrated circuit can unfortunately you can really read the inscription of it not with a camera And I think I need, I need a tripod. <laughs> this one you can read. Here I took out some keys in order to lay down, <laughs> like Scrabble, my name. Yep, that's my name. Okay, this was uh, extracting some components from a cordless keyboard. And I hope you like it. And maybe next time. See you soon.